Welcome to Kids Spaces, the show that's all about you and your space, your home and surroundings, and how they relate to your kids. Hi, I'm Debbie Marie. And I'm David Jones. You know, Debbie, when it comes to kids, the topics are wide and varied. And it just so happens we have a wide range of topics varied all over the place on today's show. For instance? For instance, how about, let's see, braces, pets, household keys, reading skills, and clean shoes on the carpet. That's a good selection, and I bet you they all have a good story to go behind them. Yes, they do. They're all on today's show. Well, stay tuned, because it's all coming up right now on Kids Spaces. <laughs> When the kids are around, there's lots of activity going on, and they go from inside and outside, dragging things into the home. You know what I'm thinking? Doormat. Absolutely, but not just any doormat. One that eliminates toxins and germs from coming inside. You sound like you have a little bit of experience with this. I kind of do. What? Your mom always said, Wipe your feet. Don't track that dirt into this house. And now, you have kids of your own, and, well, we don't have to guess what you say to them. Wipe your feet. Cleaning up dirty footprints is a hassle, especially when they end up on a rug or carpet. But what if we told you dirt is the least of your concerns when it comes to things being tracked into your home? Here to tell us what we're bringing in with the surface dirt and what we can do about it is an expert in the flooring industry, Jerry Senfrini. Jerry, welcome to Designing Spaces. Thanks for having me here today. It's great to be here. You know, most people don't realize as homeowners what they're tracking into their, their house, but we're talking about some nasty stuff here today, aren't we? You sure are. You're yeah. talking about germs. You're talking about pesticides. You're talking about gasoline, oil, animal feces. It's pretty it, nasty. It sounds like a health hazard to me. It sure is. And if you have small children or animals, it can be even worse, not to mention what you're being tracked into your house. Well, I'm always worried about the germs coming in, so I put a mat in the front of the door so you don't track them inside. Is that helping? Completely ineffective. You're kidding It's not going to do anything for you. No, it'll wipe off all the big particles on your shoes, yeah. but as far as the pesticides, the gas, the oils, the, the feet, it, none of it's coming off. Here I am thinking I'm doing something good. You're trying, but I'm trying. it's not going to work. I'm okay, sorry. But enough of the bad news. You have a solution, right? I have a solution, and it's okay. called the Magic Mat. All right. This is wonderful. So how did you come up with this idea? Fifteen years in the flooring business, I needed a product that would protect the interior of the homes after we were done installing floors. So I developed this product so that when the people came in and out, it would clean the bottom of their feet off, mm -hmm. and then further developed it into a product that could be used in every home everywhere. Can you show us how it works? Well, how it works is we have this green clean solution called the spray, and we simply spray the mat with the product, and when people come into the home, all they need to do is do a quick wipe on their feet, and it'll disinfect the bottom of your shoes, clean all the things off that you're tracking in from outside, right? and you're done. And that's normally what we do anyway, but the germs are stopping there. They're not coming into the home. Correct. It's because of the spray, the spray activates the mat, and right. together the combinations is what's going to clean the bottom of your shoes. Well, it looks like a typical mat, but of course we know it's not. So is it expensive? Not expensive because it's custom manufactured by us and mm -hmm. basically when you look at the mat, the quality of the product and the spray that you get along with it, it's comparable to anything you'd find in a, in, a, in a retail store. Well, this is fantastic for keeping our homes healthy and clean. So where can we find the Magic Mat? You can find it at magicmat.com. That's magic with a K. Well, Jerry, thank you so much for being here today. Really appreciate it. Thank you. It was my pleasure. Well, to view any part of this segment again and a link to the Magic Mat, view our website at designingspaces.tv. All right, Jerry, I want to try this out. Absolutely. Go ahead. And it seems so easy. I love it. Well, it looks like we covered everything you said at the beginning of the show. Yeah, we started right here with braces, pets, house keys, reading skills, and clean shoes on the carpet. Yep, all of those. All right, so what do we do now? Well, actually, nothing. We're out of time. I think we say goodbye. Good idea. Thanks for watching Kid Spaces. I'm David Jones. And I'm Debbie Marie. We'll see you next time. Can Bye. I? Yeah, do it, do it, do it. Yeah. Woohoo! You can visit these websites to learn more about the participants on this edition of Designing Spaces.